hi guys so i decided like i just hold my hair my phone instead of um propping it up because it was just too, too much work to figure out how to do it where i'm sitting so i'm sorry y'all are gonna have to deal with me moving around but this video um i had y'all vote on my instagram and if you don't follow my instagram it is racking up the miles um I asked y'all if you wanted to see how I budget my money and how I afford all the things that I afford. First of all, I will state that over the summer, I worked full time at the daycare I work at and I make $8 an hour. When I went in August, college started back and so I went back to working about 30, 25 to 30 hours every week. And so obviously making a lot less. So, I went through a couple weeks where I was like, oh my gosh, I'm going to die. This is bad. I can't afford anything. So, um, I did some research on budgeting, and I've never been one to budget. I always just kind of like spend what I spend and make it up for it every payday, like most people. So, then it wasn't working for me. <laughs> I needed to figure out how to budget it. So, I went on Pinterest. I went on YouTube, you know, the millennial type things to look up on. And I found, I don't know what it's called. I'll like um, write in what it's called if once I look it back up when I get off this video, when, when I stop filming this video. But it's basically where you get your check cashed every week and you get the certain amount of bills and then you put it into um, envelopes. And so it's um, the, an envelope system. And so I will just show y'all, I'm going to show y'all the real numbers from last week because <coughs> I wasn't able to cash my check. I'll show you one from two weeks ago because I wasn't able to cash my check from last week and I haven't been to the bank since, so it's just been in my account. So I'm going to show you from two weeks ago and just go back over the numbers and then go back over putting it into my um, envelopes. And I'll show you my wallet and how my wallet's set up. And I think I'm going to change a few things in it. But I'm 19 years old. I'm a full-time college student and I'm a part-time daycare worker. I make $8 an hour. And I only work 25 to 30 weeks. 30 hours. And I pay a truck payment, a phone bill. What else? In vehicle insurance on two vehicles because I have a car as well. But I don't have a payment on that because I just bought it. I have a credit card payment. I have medical, I have medical bills. I put away money every week for my horses. I put away money for my truck loan, savings, um, vet bill, um, NATRC and AERC memberships, um, my horse trailer. I put away money for Christmas, and I'll go through all my other envelopes. But I put away a lot of money, and so yeah, I will get on to. The numbers and stuffing the envelopes because apparently people really like people stuffing envelopes on YouTube. So we'll see. So, okay. So this is my notebook that I keep all my budgeting in. And so every week I pay, I get paid every week. And so that was my paycheck for, I'll use a pen so you don't have to see my ugly nails. Um, I got paid this much for this paycheck of October the 17th. And I have my truck truck loan, my credit card bill, and my phone, and that is my week my monthly bills. And then this is weekly, which I do not get out in cash. And then here are my sinking funds that I usually I don't do all of them every time. So say like let me see. Lately, I've just been putting it in horses, horse trailer, and stuff. But see, on this budget, I did all of them. And I skipped a few. But lately, I've just been skipping and only doing these because I'm focusing on building it up. So right here, I put the amount that is due each week. And each week, for the monthly bills, I divide these by four. So 53 divided by, or times four is like 210 and so I pay 210 every month and then my credit card bill I just figured in 20 because it's really only 30 dollars 
a month, but I like to pay more. And then my phone bill is $82, but I just, I don't like putting change. So I just round it up. And then I take whatever is left after my gas, which I take 40 for gas every week, which I only usually costs me 30. So, and then I take what is left right here and I divide it into how many sinking funds I have this putting in this week. And I just go from there. And this is just me subtracting each time. And then this is what I do. I count up how many 50s I need, how many 20s, how many 10s, how many 5s, and how many 1s. I get my total. This is how much I deposit of my check. And then this is how much I get out. And then I tell the bank lady I need 150, 520s, 4 1s. And then I go from there. Which I will show you now my... First, I'll show you my wallet. So, my wallet, it's hard for you to see. I, I, I do not I know how they set up their cameras for this. But my wallet has, first, all my cards and stuff right here. <coughs> on the one side. And then it has... There we go. And then it has a ring that comes out. And I have my phone sitting on a peanut butter drawer. Because I don't know how people do this. But this is supposed to be my spending thing. But I don't ever put stuff in here. And my gas. But I keep my gas in my account. So I'll probably just change these. And then this is for my horse trailer. And I write down how much I have in it each week. And I add to it. Funds. Or funds slash clothing. How much I have in it. Gifts slash Christmas. Those are all the ones I keep in my wallet. Because this is the stuff I buy most often. And if you want to know which wallet this is, I got it off of Amazon. I will link it in the description. It did come with all the, um, um the, <coughs> the cash envelopes. So, here are the rest of the cash envelopes. These are the ones that I, that I either skipped or that I already have paid in full. Like, I got my check back from the college because I get financial aid. And so I just went ahead and I put away all my money for my vehicle insurance. And so I don't have that. I don't have to take that out of my check every week. <coughs> and then medical, I don't owe anything right now because I stopped going to the chiropractor. I'm not putting anything in savings. I, I really should, but I don't right now. And then I went ahead and I paid my vet bill that was due. I should probably continue saving it, but I just haven't. I've been focusing on other things. Uh, and then the memberships, I haven't been putting money back either. So those are just the ones I've been skipping. And then here are all the ones outside of my wallet that I do I put away every week. So my truck loan, my credit card, my phone bill, the horse account. That's it. And so I got... Let me get it. So, as I said before, I got, man, how do they do this? Let's, see. Oh, let's I'm just going to hold my phone. So, I got 150, 1, 2, 3, 4, 2, 3, 4. Oh. One of the 20s is missing because I went ahead and paid my credit card bill. That's what it is. One, two, three, four. So I should have five, but I don't because I went ahead and paid my credit card bill. So there is that. And now I will stuff my cash envelopes following the list. So I'm first going to get my truck loan and put 53, one, two, three, and then there's nothing already in there. Most of the time, if there's money already in there, I'll just like count it and make sure. And then I do have a budget sheet that I put in it every week. So I know exactly how much is in there. And that one is full. And then I already paid my credit card bill, so I can't put anything in there. So now my phone bill. 
which is $21. I put 21. And then I'll set out what's already in there, which I already have 20, 40, And then the rest I have is $60 that I'm putting into sinking funds, which is horses, trailer, and gift. So the one that's outside of my wallet is horses. I just put 20 and I like to put all my bills in order. I don't know about y'all, but I'm kind of OCD about that. So, I have 50. My phone keeps sliding. Sorry. 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 158 and that is correct on my budget sheet as you can see I spend a lot in this one I just bought scoot boots which is a lot of my money has gone out of this and I don't like it I feel like I need my money back and then the other two 20s are for my trailer fund and my gift fund which are both in my wallet We'll get trailer out. And there's a lot in there. So. Let's put this 20, 20, 40, 30, oh, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 2, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. two. That should be 250. I counted wrong. 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 50, 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95. Hmm. I don't know. Oh, no, I'm short. Oh, I'm short. Oh, okay. There's, I have 40 more dollars. So there is 250, and my phone keeps signing off as being a motor drop. So there's 250. Which I really need to stop carrying that in my wallet. Because that is a lot of money to carry around. But. And lastly is gifts slash Christmas. Which only gets 20. Let me get all of it out this time. Last time I didn't get it all out. So. We will add the 20. 20, 40, 60. 71, 2, 72, is that what it says on the paper? Yes. So. Um, so, that is pretty much how I budget it. I do everything like that. And then all the extra money that I get from the envelope, say this one, I budget 21 a week. And so, 
if I do 21 a week, 21 times 4 is 21, 4, 4, it's 8. So, I have $2 extra, which I mean, $2 extra is not a lot, but that $2 will go into this jar in my room where I put all my cushion money. So, like, all my extra money every month that I get out of these envelopes um, will go back into my cushion fund, which is basically my savings because I don't actually spend it. I just look at all the $1 bills and I'm like, okay, I'm not taking those anywhere. So, I hope you enjoy this video and I'm sorry if it's not as good as quality as most people. I really do not know how to set up cameras. I'm going to learn, I promise. So, um, I hope this helps you. It really has helped me. I went from freaking out like every, all the time to really knowing what to do. So, um, that is a realistic of how I do my money and... I hope you guys enjoy it, and I hope you like, comment, and subscribe. Check out the Instagram. Sorry, my nails are dirty. I'm equestrian. Leave me alone. So, y'all have a good night, and yeah.